guest is an Emmy award-winning actor, author, performer, and as of yesterday, he is now also officially an astronaut. Back from his trip to outer space with Blue Origin, please welcome the one and only William Shatner! No, that's what I'm talking about! Hey! Oh, my gosh. I'm... Oh, my God, an astronaut. We're not really, you know, astronauts, really, they go up and they do things. We're half astronauts. No, 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 half astronauts. Half astronauts. Astronauts. Thank you. Yeah. Uh, uh, William, I, I'm so happy to see you, and I, I, I really wanted to talk to you. This is so exciting for me because I just loved it so much, and I'll tell you why I loved it. Uh, one is because obviously you spent a majority of your life talking about space and you know Star Trek and your Captain Kirk. Here's why I really loved it. You come down, you land in this desert thing, you come out of the capsule. Uh, Jeff Bezos comes over, then he comes in with champagne, and he's like. Woohoo! And you go, no, hey, no, abs no, not now, buddy. No, absolutely not. I don't want the champagne. I'm, I got to think about what just happened. Well, uh, you know the 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 whole effect of going into space and and seeing what very few people have seen, and there's no frame of reference. How do you how do you describe weightlessness? How do you describe? seeing palpable darkness, blackness of space where there's no filter of dust or dirt or re reflections of light. It's there. It's like hanging there. It's evil. It seems like the, the monster. And then you look down and you see this precious thing, this warm, nurturing earth, and you see death and life and you descend, and then you're overwhelmed by the possibility of the Earth ending in a short while, and, and your life is in front of you. But the message is interesting. The message is we all need a wake-up call every so often in our lives where your, your life is threatened uh, by something. You may have a near accident, or you, you, somebody uh, you love has died, and all of a sudden you look at your life and say, wait a minute, what's important here? And you have that wake-up call, and you need it every so often because then, you know, coming and telling jokes is very important, and you lose sight of the fact that, that yes, that's important. But what is equally and perhaps more important is caring, loving. Uh, uh, the, the planet is going to be inundated unless we do something about it. I mean, really uh, uh, bad, and we got to do something about it, and what are we going to do about it, and what are we going to do with my life? And so all the deep things that we should be thinking about every so often we need to be reminded and that moonshot that that thing that did it to me and i was i was overwhelmed by all the things we need to do and, and the loves and the and the losses i was just it was an enormous moment for me that i never expected i too have an album called bill that's out there and there's a song on there so close so far from the moon a time in my life when they walked on the moon and I was so far from it. And here I was, 50 years later, so close to the moon. And, and it was very meaningful to me. I, the, the, the album, by the way, which I just listened to, it's getting great reviews, and uh, I, I love it. I go, wow, William Shatner's a new record. It's getting great reviews. I loved it. I, I, I know that you were saying in interviews before you did this trip that you were going to write a song about this. Uh, are you still going to write a song, or and has yeah, that song changed? Just, thank you, Jimmy. The 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 other part of that, the other astonishing part, was that uh, 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 Dan Miller uh, and, and Rob the poet and I have worked on this album, and it's a beautiful album, it's a work of love, and and uh, and as, as you say, it's getting astonishing reviews. We met in New York a few days ago and said, you know, we've got to write a song about. It. Bill going up into space and what's the song about? And we started to talk about what it's going to be like. You know, the blue orb and the thing you see. And I called Rob the poet when I came down. I said, toss out everything we talked about. Going up there and having that experience is nothing like what you hear about. I, I just want to say also on behalf, I, I just, I thought it was great that you did it. I, I think it was also, my, maybe also a wake-up call for all of us too, just to, when you get a chance, just tell someone you love them. Uh, so, uh, yeah. We love you, buddy. William Shatner, everybody! He went to space! He's an astronaut! He's returned! It's William Shatner! Hey, hey.